and it's going. Isn't that wicked? That's what we call the Queen Conk right here. You see his eyes? grabbing onto David. Now, you feel that thing that's like a thumbnail? It's exactly what ours is. It's an operculum, just like a thumbnail. That's what we get me. Yeah, yep. And a lot of times people think that they're getting pinched. What happens, they pick them up, and their little thumbnail closes with their finger in there. It feels like a good pinch. But the queen conch, super illegal to, to take these guys out of the water. We're only picking them up to educate, you know, as a marine scientist, help educate the world about these queen conchs. Like when you guys came to visit Key West, if you had any conch fritters or anything like that, you're actually eating conch from the Bahamas um, because it's very illegal to harvest the conchs here. The reason why is we ate too many for too long and the numbers just went down and down and down. Well, the numbers actually have been getting up so well, before Irma anyway, it's kind of hard to have a good count on them now, um, but the numbers were getting so well that we were thinking about even putting a harvest on within the next oh, decade. Really? Because if we allow these guys to get too plentiful, they'll sit there and just ravish all the competition in the seagrass beds like where we found these little critters. Yeah. But it's awesome because when they're born, they start out like a, a little larvae, like a flywood, a, a maggot. I think and I have they, one in it. You it do? It might be a larvae, I don't know. Really? The one you're holding? No, it's up Oh, back there at home? Somewhere. Oh, I up see. Up there somewhere. Oh, I see. So it might be a live shell. Well, I'll make sure it's just a it's just a shell. That way we don't take anything and hurt any live critters. We wouldn't want to do that. But when they start out, they start out like this is what he used to look like. So they grow down and they grow out. So this guy keeps spinning around and around and around and around. Oh, it's cool. Yeah, isn't that cool? There's nothing in there. That'd just be cool necklace. But these guys just keep spinning around and around. And these guys, I can tell, are all juveniles. Because they've all, this one right here, Is this a girl? it's starting to flip out a little bit. It's young like you. But when they're adults, they start to get what's called the flaring lip. And that's like the symbol of maturity, saying, hey, I'm old enough to have a girlfriend uh, or a boyfriend behind? now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> probably just a piece of rock or something floating around. No, but you want to be the one that lets these guys go too? I want someone to you. Yeah? Oh. oh. Thank you. <laughs> what a gentleman. So are we just You're going to get down? all the ladies later. <laughs> just set them down? Yes, ma'am. That's my girl. Woo! How cool. Rock on. So what else? Found it. Those are the lessons of the day. Now we're going to go do some fishing. What is that? What am I on? Cool. I thought I was looking at you. <laughs> Not me. All right, say bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs>